Systems activated. Teleportation has commenced in T minus three, two, one. If Gordon Freeman was real, he'd open these doors with a damned crowbar. But hell, locked doors and blocked off pathways don't surprise me. I don't think I can be surprised anymore, not after everything I've gone through. I know where I'm at. What do you want? Man, I wish I could just kick them around. But I got a better idea! The itchy bitchy spiders came out the freaking vents. Out came the train floor to hack them into segments. Out came some more to join the freaking fray. And the itchy bitchy spiders had better learn to pray. Ouch! That didn't hurt too much. I just noticed their heads aren't upside down. Another species of spiders? Stop it! How many are there? Hey, go get a room. I'm actually having fun with this. And as much fun as that was, I'd like to try it out on something bigger. Any surprises? And here we go! Feel the wrath of the golden blade! This makes one hell of a substitute weapon when I'm low on ammunition. I'd be smart to prolong this strategy as long as possible. I got the soul cube, so I can recover myself if I get hurt attempting to dismantle them with the chainsaw. Wow, that is one long climb. It'd be nice if the Soul Cube had a secondary purpose. That's right, help me to the upper levels. At least one dead whispering voice proves to be a post-intelligent person. Can you imagine if all the zombies were that smart? They'd be like, hey man, the douchebag marine dickwad is gonna pop out of the vents. Let's surprise them. They don't have any fucking clue. Let's see if I can sneak up on this guy and shove this chainsaw up his ass like a vibrator. Yeah, he liked it. Oh crap. I'll be honest. If I saw a squad mate of mine get sawed in half by an enemy, I wouldn't take a second to think about charging in like that. The thoughts would be pretty petrifying. On the other hand, I did get my shotgun back, and some more ammunition. Oh look, it's Grim Reaper's ex-wife that raises the dead! And it's got the hots for me! While I'm inclined to be flattered, here's a toy! That whore. I can see why they'd make a bad couple. Reaper's out killing people 24-7. And this fucker's raising men with 5 foot long testicles for personal use. Here, have a cube. Oh, you almost had me. Just come around. There you go. Then again... There's so many of them. It's only logical that Reaper's having an affair. But... But how would they... do it? I mean... Reaper's all bones. No boner. Maybe that's why the marital stats is so busted. Whoa, 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 whoa! Whoa! No! He couldn't hit jack shit, so he thought it'd be smarter to get closer. With the chain gun. Speaking of boner! You know what? Screw this! 
He wouldn't even be able to make a landing inside a planet's atmosphere if he jumped off a freaking cliff. I sort of recognize this place. Funny thing is, I don't know where the heck I'm going. Or where I'm supposed to be going. Where'd Sarge been? That dickwad never showed his face anywhere in Delta. Yeah, I remember this. I'm going in circles, aren't I? Damn it. I don't think this was green before. Alright. Swan? Still alive? <coughs> Looks like you might be on your own. On my own. Sarge is gone. I've noticed. I've got to him. I don't know how long he's been working against us. Uh, Come again? He's no longer human. Campbell went after him. He's got to be stopped. That scumball! Hell is breaking through in the caverns. If that portal isn't closed before those ships arrive, Earth will be destroyed. Earth. <coughs> That's what they've always wanted. They were there once. Lost it in the dawn of time. Now it's so close. I can taste it. It's up to you now. <laughs> Take my PDA and Scott what you need. Good luck. Here we go again, all on me. This crisis needs a change. Why don't you tag along? You don't look so bad. I'm too beat up. I'll slow you down. That's not the point. I need bait. Or some kind of decoy. Ah, fuck it. I've always had bad vibes about Sarge. At first, I thought it was because he looked like an old geezer with the desire to molest me. When it comes to people, my natural instincts seem to malfunction when it comes to first impressions. Guess I'll go underneath again. It's always soothing when these vents are clean. Suffering and He sure does like to repeat himself, even though he does nothing to back up his words. Did I make a wrong turn? Oh. Well, there is one good thing about what's been going on recently. I get to kick Sarge's ass without feeling bad. Or should I say, kick his balls. And then drag his balls across Petruger's face. I'd make for one screwed up demon if I ever got possessed, wouldn't I? I would single handedly bring the end to everything on Mars. Cause I'm that good. Seriously, what's with you and the tentacles? Yeah, I got skills. Come here, lovebird. I don't want to brag, but I probably could have made it this far with the chainsaw the whole time. Well, those UAC numbnuts with guns would have made that a bit challenging. Even with guns, they suck. I bet Sarge is no better than them if I ever had a one-on-one -on -one with him. He'd probably need a big ass gun versus me. What am I doing? Gosh damn, I hate those homing rockets. Those rockets would be the most lethal weapon if I were in an open field. They'd probably chase me for hours until I tire out. But that ain't the case here. Let's find Sergeant Betruger, do some dirty work, and get the hell out of this place. <laughs>